I'm gonna show you how to make this pasta sauce today. It's loaded with veggies that have a lot of anti-inflammatory properties, good for the gut, super fresh, great for summer, and delicious. Okay, so we've got our water on a boil, and then I'm gonna measure with my heart and just pour out however much pasta I feel like. Listen for if it's boiling over. So all in a blender, super easy for the sauce. About two cups of spinach, about a cup of basil. I'm feeling like three tablespoons of nutritional yeast. I love nutritional yeast. I think it's a perfect ingredient and I put it on everything. Gives like a cheesy, savory, just delicious flavor. There's also like lots of B vitamins fortified into this. So if you are vegan, not only does it taste, give you like that cheesy vibe, but it also gives you those nutrients that you might be missing. We're gonna do two tablespoons of tahini, creamy tahini. I mean, it's in the name. It's gonna make it creamier. That's what we want. The oil rises to the top, so you wanna give it a little mix. Oh my God, it's making funny sounds. <laughs> okay, pasta's ready. God, it's so hot. Be better than me and use a towel. Yeah. Learn from my mistakes. I'm not gonna shake the water out. I'm just gonna pour it back in. It's, there's gonna be some water left out at the bottom, but I kind of like that. It's gonna go into the sauce. And you know how you add some water, pasta water to sauce to make it starchy, thicken it up? I want some of that. And then we're gonna go in with about two tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil, that tasty stuff. And you know it's good when they've got a completely opaque bottle, really protecting it from the sun. If you didn't know, sunlight damages good quality olive oil, so that's why that's cool. Measuring. And next, we're gonna have our lima beans. Lima beans or butter beans work for this. They have a really creamy texture, so that's what we're wanting here. They're also really high in iron, and your girl is anemic, so I love that for me. And then I wanted to add a little bit of lemon zest and juice. I just love lemon zest. I feel like it makes things taste fancy, like super fresh and delicious. And then the juice of, I don't know, however much this is. That's what I'm feeling. Um, lemon smells so good. So we've got our ga garlic powder. However much you're feeling, I'm just gonna like, yeah, that feels good. We're gonna do salt to taste vegetable broth because we're doing it vegan. I'm not vegan, but I think that making vegan foods is fun because it's like entertaining to make it taste really savory and delicious. Nice. Okay. Pretty. Okay, yum. Look how pretty that looks. This is a no waste household. So we're gonna scrape down the bottoms here. Oh my God. Mm -hmm. Does this look good to you? It looks really good. <laughs> I love lemon zest. Who doesn't love tiny, cute, fresh basil? That looks yummy. Okay. But it's so good. <laughs> mm. 